So the little motion camera for the Xbox One and Xbox 360, especially recently, has been dwindling. I'm probably one of like four people who actually got an Xbox One without a Kinect and then bought one after. And really at that time, nobody cared about Kinect. Well, after seven years now, Microsoft is finally ending the Kinect. Basically, Fast Co Designs was interviewing the Kinect team at Xbox, and they pretty much just confirmed that the Kinect has been discontinued. The original Kinect for the 360 was discontinued in 2016 along with the Xbox 360, but now the Xbox One version is coming to a close. I'm honestly shocked that the Kinect has stayed alive for this long. According to the article I pulled this from, only 35 million Kinects have been sold worldwide. 25 million 360 Kinects have been sold, and only 10 million Xbox One Kinects. And somehow the Kinect brand has lasted longer than the original Xbox in some countries. Why did Microsoft discontinue the Kinect so late? I don't know, but I guess better late than ever? The Xbox 360 Kinect was personally a favorite. It wasn't really the motion control gimmick that I liked, hell I still have some motion control games that I haven't even opened for it, but I just used it for its microphone. And the microphone itself wasn't bad. Then once I finally got an Xbox One in like very late 2015 I think, I know, what a great time to get an Xbox One, right? It's not like the Xbox One S is right around the corner. I purchased an Xbox One Kinect because I wanted to livestream using its video camera and microphone. I didn't care one bit that it had motion control games. The Kinect is a very unique device, and I don't hate it, but I think, and a lot of other people feel the same, that it did do a whole lot of damage to the Xbox One when it first came out, because think about it, why would you buy a $500 game console that's less powerful than its competitors, or at least one of them, and its more powerful competitor was cheaper. The PS4 was only $400 at the time, and also the Wii U for $300 or $350 for the deluxe kit. And just nobody wanted the $500 Xbox One with the Kinect, and it crippled the Xbox brand ever since in my opinion. So I hope you did enjoy this video. It would be appreciated if you shared this video, but it's always up to you. I'll have a link to my other social medias in the description, and see you.